Hi, I'm Doreen from Munster Bovine and as well as focusing on picking up repeats, um, we also need to focus on stock bull management to reduce the lull in calving in March and also to reduce the number of empty cows at the year end. Stock bulls running with dairy cows have an awful lot more work to do than stock bulls running with heifers or suckler cows. Because firstly they have to walk twice a day with the cows to the actual parlour. They have to work hard checking a hundred cows to pick up one or two in heat. And they are often serving cows on roadways where they are more prone to storm bruising and injuries as they actually dismount cows. Also, these stock bulls have not received much pre-season training. They've had no lead to prepare for the championship. They're thrown in at the deep end. They're expected to play daily with very little rest and no recovery. So what we need to do is firstly look at how many empty cows have we left to be bred? Have we a mature bull or a young bull and get our ratios right? A young bull will pick up 15 to 20 empty cows if he's managed correctly. A mature bull will pick up 20 to 30. However, we really need to watch these bulls and manage them carefully. Firstly, make sure each bull is fertility tested by your vet. Secondly, for the first 10 to 14 days after releasing the bull with the herd, continue AI because this will allow you the bull time to settle in and it will avoid the lull in calving that we often see as we move from short gestation AI sires to the longer gestation uh, stock bull. Each day where you have more than two cows in heat, AI them. The bull will actually pick them up in heat for you. Also, if you're after a period of synchronization and a lot of repeats coming together, AI for those three to four days. Fit that bull with an actual chin ball, because then you'll actually know he's work rate and you know when he's actually coming under pressure. If you have multiple bulls on the farm, you'll maximize their use by giving them 24 hours on, 24 hours off. That 24 hours off allows the bull to rest it gets rid of dominance issues where a dominant bull may not allow a subordinate bull to actually mate. It'll maximize your conception rates and it'll also reduce the amount of actually wasted matings on the farm. If your stock bull gets lame or injured, rest him. And if he runs a high temperature or is a farm getting fertility tested before he joins the actual main hunt.